Well, the Mississippi River has crested at 19.6 feet in Lansing. This is drone video provided to us from Main Street Lansing. You can see water surrounding some buildings there nestled up right against the riverside. The crest happened just this afternoon. This is the fourth highest crest on record for Lansing. The city of Dubuque has closed A.Y. McDonald Park's boat ramp due to flooding. The ramp will stay closed until floodwaters recede to a safer level. Officials are reminding people there to be cautious around the river and obey street closures. Well, we're also learning more about a train derailment that sent train cars and engines into the rising Mississippi River yesterday afternoon. Happened near DeSoto, Wisconsin, just across the river from Lansing. Crawford County Emergency Management says both law enforcement and hazmat crews are on the scene. They're working around the clock, we're told, until cleanup is complete. The the BNSF train was carrying hazardous materials and other cargo. This included lithium ion batteries, oxygen containers, and paint. Two rail cars went into the water as flooding in that area continues. And this morning, we heard directly from the emergency management director about the rail cars that entered the river. He says there's no harm to the community nor the environment. We were able to detain that was a non-hazardous material in there, and uh, there was no risk to the public. So. We got real lucky that we were able to uh, shore everything up and then continue on to go down to the lock and dam. Now we do know that four BNSF train employees did have to go to the hospital. It was a precaution, we're told. And right now, parts of State Highway 35 in that area have been shut down just to help with the cleanup process.